Hello, I'm Thomas Lee Warren. I'm the Chief Technologist for R Square Data Labs for Rolls Royce. R Squared Data Labs is populated with people who they do nothing but think and dream about data and what you can do with data. How data can transform your business, whether it's about collecting data so that you can analyze and identify things that are anomalies to the normal operation, whether you can actually use data with machine learning to reimagine products and services that your customer hasn't even thought about. But when they see it, they go, that's what I want. And that's what's at the core of who we are in R Square Data Labs. It's all about the data and the power that data provides to a business. Rolls Royce has actually been at the forefront of advanced analytics and data engineering for about the last 30 years. So, in the last year, we've actually pioneered a concept called the cell. Now, this cell is a collection of a diverse set of highly specialist skills, whether it be people who understand commercial value, to business analysts, to data engineers, to uh, data scientists, uh, AI experts, uh, software engineers. We've brought them all together into this cell concept. Now, that cell concept, after speaking to the customer and understanding exactly what the customer needs to derive the value, it continues to work together uh, as one complete unit all the way until that value is delivered into the marketplace. So AI, a lot of people have heard about autonomous vehicles and that's about how do we use AI to almost replace a skilled individual and that is not where we are at Rolls-Royce. We have so many skilled people and what we're thinking about AI is how do we actually assist our skilled workforce to better accomplish their work? How do we actually remove the monotonous jobs? How do we focus them on actually what excites them and what gets them out of bed in the morning? There's just so many ways that we think AI is going to help. How do we make all of the engines that we build perform in the most optimum way? How do we make them as noiseless as possible? And that's all about how do we use AI in the design, in the manufacturing, and in the after-sales phases of our business.